Hello guys, welcome to Afronix. Today we are going to see how to detect brain tumor using MATLAB. And the version of MATLAB that I'm using is MATLAB 2018A. Alright, we start our project straight by typing into the command window guide. Click enter. A window like this will pop up. So we go for blank. Another window like this will pop up. Let us maximize. Expand the work area. Alright. This is how we are going to set up our platform. First, we load an image. Filter it using median filtering. Then, we do the edge detection. It will detect the edges of the image. Then, it will show us where the tumor lies on the brain. And mind you, this picture that we'll be uploading is an MRI picture, right? A scan picture. So let us set up our screen by going to this axis. Click on it. We need one here. All right. Let us edit this. Double click. Then we go to X stick. Here is X stick try to make it from auto to manual then we clear off this labels okay then we go to x color x colors here we change from black to white we take white okay then we move on to y y tick here is white tick. From here, we change from auto to manual. Click on these labels, clear them off. Okay. Then we go to white color from black to white. Okay. Press enter. Then we close. This is our screen. So we need four of these. So all you need to do is to click, say copy, control V to paste. Align it nicely. Align this properly. Good. So next, here will be the screen that will be displaying the images. Alright, so we need a push button that will serve as an action. Okay, you click and then the image will appear, detect, so on and so forth. So we hang over, move on to push button, click on it. You can place it here. Okay, now let us edit this push button. Now we need um, first the font, let the font be 30 enter then the foreground color we change it to let me give it uh, something like um, let's say blue and then we come to the label this one will be to upload image Then the tag so that when we'll be programming it will be very easy for us to identify which push button we are working with. Same. Then we close. Now you can copy, search, paste. Good. So now they are the same. So we have to edit this part. Click. We just need to edit the label. So this one will be median. Now here it will be. Okay. Press enter. Close. So it is here, medium filtering. Let us expand it. OK. 
and let me change the font to 20. Okay, this one come to the label. Let us change this one also to 20 or space and also we come to the label. Instead of upload, we just say this one is going to detect the edge. Say edge. Edge detection. Click enter. Close. So this one will be detecting the edges. Now last one will be let us change the font to 20. Then we go to the string, change it to now the tag will be all right so far so good so what we need to do if you click on play here say yes okay now we can name it as brain underscore tumor underscore say detector so save so here is our platform we upload the image then do the median filtering we we'll do edge detection and then we we'll do the tumor detection. So now let us go into the program and see. We now go to the code. If you're here, you just right click. And then you go to editor. Then it will take you to the code. And mind you, I have already written the code and because of time to save time. But I will explain to you how does it work. Okay, first scroll down. Now, let us run this first and see. Okay, here is our platform. We try to upload an image. Click upload. So, here are the images of the brain. The MRI um, um, scan results. So, if let's say we click on this. Open. Here is the image. Then the median filtering took place here. Then it detected the edges and also the tumor has been detected here. Now here is the solidity and then here is the white tissue of the tumor. Alright, so now let us go into the code and explain how does it work. Let me close this. Here was our first um push button which says that select image so this one as we did in the previous videos that how to select an image from your computer and load it into MATLAB so if you haven't seen this video just check in the description below you will see the links to all of these videos that we've made before or you go through them and you will understand what is happening here we take our image from our computer unload it and then we show it an on axis one what is axis one here is our axis one our first screen axis two axis three axis four all right then we have we go to the median filtering on the median filtering we try to filter out okay from the rgb to gray scale so the rgb that means from colored to a gray scale then from that that is using the if condition from there we use our this med field this is a function in matlab that does the median filtration so by using that we are able to filter out all the noises then we send it to the axis 2 so that axis 2 will hold this image all right and the title has been given to it as med filter okay like median filter then we go to this one edge detection we are trying to detect the edges of the image by using this um, med 
filtering also we're able to achieve it we run our for loop so that um, it will detect the area of the image and then try to circle or put up um, a bright white line around the area of the edges okay then that image would be shown on axis 3 and the label is given to it as edge detection then we move on to this tumor detection and the tumor detection we try to uh, make axis 4 to hold the picture that has been uploaded and then we use mid filtering again to filter out certain areas and then we go to this to this area where we set up our threshold and the threshold is like this that above 70 percent will be considered as white and below that will be taken as black then from here we come to set up our solidity okay our solidity by using the state um, region props okay we have the solidity and the area and then we try to look at the density density will be equals to solidity and also the area also state dot area now we are looking at the high density area we are how can we um like we want to set up our threshold that a place is considered as a high dense area when density is greater than 50 percent Okay. so then we label our areas and then label our tumor area then we come to this part we set up our morphological operation and this operation is by setting a pixel of the image meaning that we have to separate the white area tissue area of the brain where the tumor is from the rest of the image meaning the white tissue area will be recycled and then we try to look and the brain you can get white tissues around the brain but we want to see an area where it is well compacted then it will circulate that area as tumor all right so that's what you did and then we set off our boundary and the boundary is to circulate that particular area dense area of white tissue and then we don't want any holes and that image will be shown okay on the screen then we say hey hang on hold on we want to set up a for loop that will try to set up and plot this area and the boundary of the tumor from the rest of the brain will be circulated by our yellow color circles then from there and we try to title our this image and it will be shown as a detected image and then we take off the hang on all right then we show the image then we show the image on axis 4 so that's what the code is all about but if you face any problem or any troubles feel free to leave comment below and we will reach on to you as soon as possible all right and the good thing is that um if you check in the description below you will find a link to a website where you can download this code and also the explanation of the code with diagrams and well designed structured post which will aid you in learning more about this project and you download this code as well as this GUI figure here you can manipulate you can put a lot of things like change different different areas all right so let us run the code again once more go to upload image then let us select this open here it is medium filtering clear out the noise detect the edges okay with a bright white light right and then say did show us where the tumor lies so it says we have some white tissues around but it ignored it and look for the high dense area of white tissues okay so we upload another one again we have the right here and now we share this one um, 
I will share this image. Let us take this one. And then you'll be wondering which area it will be circulating. Okay, let's filter it out. And then it detected the edges. Then here is where it lies. So it's just looking for a high dense area of white tissue. So guys, this is how you go about in doing brain tumor detection using MATLAB GUI. So far, I want to say thank you for watching this video.